Yo, what's good, man? What's good? What's good? 2v2 two two. YouTubers goodie. It's your boy Protect, man. Your boy Tones. About no video today. And today, I have FTF Fix This Franchise, episode four. Um, This will probably be also a one-part episode. Um, I do like the, I, do, I like this team front office a lot. So the front office is not really an issue to me. I want to get to the roster. That's it. Um, this this segment will be on this episode of this segment will be on the Los Angeles Chargers. Can't call them Super Chargers no more. They're not in San Diego, so. But Los Angeles Chargers, cuz let's get into it, baby. Um, right now the Chargers are four and seven. They just took an L on Thursday night, I believe. Yes, they lost on Monday night. That was Monday night to the um Kansas City Chiefs, uh, twenty four seventeen. Um, another tough loss. I think like five, zero and four, zero and five in one score games. It's it, it's been tough for this for the Los Angeles Chargers to get things going like they had last year in these one score games. Um, I'm going to give you my opinions on the roster, what they need to fix. The Chargers might be going to a slight retooling slash small rebuild. Let me explain. Philip Rivers' days as a starting quarterback are done. You can book done. Done, daughter. Done. This man been throwing picks all over the damn place. This man can't place the ball right. He's literally turned the ball over everywhere. He's been a turnover machine. He has looked terrible this season. And and I like Phillip Rivers, but he's been horrible. He's been awful. And it's time to move on from Phillips. Phillip Rivers, your days as a Los Angeles Charger are officially over. You could book that. They're not resigning you. They're not giving an extension. You are done. Your Los Angeles Chargers tenure is over. I think the NFL career is over. I think it's done. I think you're finished. It was nice knowing you. Adios. So, that, so now you have a huge void on your roster. Quarterback. You have a top 15 draft pick. Probably. Um, who do you take? Who do you take? You take quarterback. Um, other than quarterback, you have a couple other needs, I think, as well. Um, maybe tight end. Because Hunter Henry has been having injury issues. Um, he had the ACL a couple years back. Um, it just seemed like sometimes he can't stay on the field enough. Um, he's kind of reminding me of what I'm saying, Jordan Reed, but not as bad with the injuries. But he has been injury, kind of injury prone over the time of his Los Angeles Chargers career. So you probably need a, a nice backup tight end, I think, in my opinion as well. But it's not really a huge need. The huge need is quarterback. That supersedes everything, of course. Um, but obviously, I think you're fine, like Keenan Allen, like Mike Williams, uh, like Travis Benjamin. You have some nice receivers over there in, in, in Los Angeles. I'm not worried about the Chargers receiving core. Um, the offensive line is solid. Could use a little upgrade at left tackle, maybe. Um, probably can move Okun to right tackle and drop the little legit left tackle. Um, but right now, quarterback such a big need that you probably wait to left tackle to, to 2021 draft. So. With that being said, let's get into fix this franchise. I'm going to go really deep into this roster. Um, I'm not going to talk about just the offense, but the defense. The defense needs a little work too. Thomas Davis getting up there in age, a linebacker. Um, you can use an upgrade there. Uh, I, li I like Ingram and Bosa rushing the passer. Um, I like Casey Hayward, Desmond King, and Boyce the cornerback. Um, I think safety is okay, you, especially Derwin James coming back from uh, injury. That's a huge injury to them. Um, that was a huge, huge, huge injury for them. And they're, he's literally the defensive superstar on the team. And um, they need him back in the worst way. Uh, 2019, I think it's done for them. Uh, they are a potential playoff team. So I, I kind of, I'm going to kind of digress for a second. They're not making the playoffs. You can book that now. The Los Angeles Chargers are not making the postseason. I think they finished at 7 and 9 ish. Um, missed the postseason. Uh, time, for, time for it changes in Los Angeles. Now, get back to the defense. Uh, Derwin James is a superstar on this team. I really think I love Derwin James. I wish the Washington Redskins took him at the 13th pick at a damn 2017 NFL draft. And you take the wrong pain. I'm sorry. Let me chill. 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 So, that being said, I wish, I wish Derwin James was watching the Redskins. So, you know how much I like Derwin James, okay? So, Derwin James is a monster. Um, So, the safety, I think you're fine. Uh, cornerback, I like Casey Hayward and Desmond King, like I already stated. They became a really good punt return, except when we try to catch wild punts and try to catch over show like these. Like, bro, what are you doing? <laughs> but outside of that, I do like Desmond King a lot. Um, you have a really tight roster in uh, Los Angeles, I'll be honest, but you need a new quarterback, you need a new voice at that position, you need a new guy. 
Phillip Rivers has lost it. I I'll be honest. He's brought all these passing yards. He's making some big plays here and there. But he's such a turnover machine that's holding you back. Now, at, at, that, at that 12 to 15 range, who can you draft? Um, of course, Joe Burrow will be long gone. Tua could be there at 12 because of the whole injury thing. But do you want to take Tua now, though? You want to touch Tua? Probably not. So your next best bet is Justin Herbert out of Oregon. Um, he's on the West Coast. He's not that far from you. Um, you probably seen this kid play a few times. I like Justin Herbert's game a lot. I don't love it, but I do like it. I think um I think Anthony Lynn's a very, very, very innovative guy. Um, I think he will show uh a new type of offense for the Los Angeles Chargers. A little more RPOs, not the standard drop back passing that Phil Rivers has been doing for so long. With that being said, if they could build an offense around Justin Herbert, you have the weapons. You got Melvin Gordon, Justin Jackson, Austin Eckler's been going nuts. Um, Ken Allen, Mike Williams, Travis Benjamin, Hunter Henry. You have the weaponry in Los Angeles for Justin Herbert. Literally, this offense is all set. Left tackle quarterback's all you need. Honestly, no, no bull crap. Like, dead serious. You get a left tackle next.